Hello everyone. Namaste from Joy of Reading. Today's story is What's Neema Eating Today? The author is Bijal Vacharajani and illustrator is Priya Kurian and the publisher is Pratham Books. So this girl is Neema and what is she eating today? Let's find out. Meet Neema. Just like you, she loves food, which is why Neema is always eating and eating. So this is the girl Neema and she loves food. So she's always eating, eating all the time, some food or the other. Chomp, chomp, chew, chew. Mmm, mmm. Oh ho, close your mouth while chewing, Nima. So, when you eat food, you bite. Mm, mm, mm. All sounds come and right. So, if you open your mouth and eat, you hear that sound, right? So, it is not good manners to open your mouth and eat. So, always while you're eating, close your mouth and then eat so that you don't give off all those weird sounds. When it's summer, the days are happy and long and it's warm outside. What's Nima eating today? So in summer, the days are long because the sun is there for a longer time. It's also warm and it's nice, bright and everything, right? So what does Nima eat during the summertime? Summer is the season to eat Mangoes, yellow, green, and red. Slippery white lychees with bright red coats. Green striped and butter yellow watermelons. Juicy mulberries that burst in the mouth. Oh, oh, Nima's hands are all sticky and purple now. So, summer. What are some of the fruits that we see? Mangoes and they come in yellow color, green color and red color. And then these are lychees. They have a bright red color outside and inside it is white in color, a very sweet fruit. And then of course you have watermelons that are striped. Striped are these lines you can see here, right? That is stripes. And of course these mulberries when you bite them itself, the juice just comes out like that. Uh oh, now you can see Nima's hand. They're all sticky because of those fruits. And then they are purple in color because the last fruit she ate was this juicy mulberries here. When it's monsoon, the dark and frowning clouds roll in and it's raining outside. What's Nima eating today? So during monsoon season, it is the season when rain pours and comes. So there are dark clouds in the sky. So what is Nima going to eat during the monsoon season? Monsoon is the season to eat corn, yellow, white and purple, fresh and juicy sweet limes, pineapples with crowns on their heads, purple and squishy jamuns. Oh ho, Nima's tongue is all fuzzy and blue. So during the rainy season, we get a lot of corn. This is corn that you see in Nima's hand is corn. It comes in yellow color, sometimes white color, and even purple color at times. And of course, the sweet limes that, are, that have a lot of juice. Mosambi, you've heard about it, right? That is sweet lime. And then this fruit is pineapple. And look at them on their head. They have a crown, just like kings wear a crown on their head, right? The pineapple has a crown of leaves on its head. And this is the purple colored jamun. Squishy means it is like a soft and then a, a moist as well, wet. So when you have a banana, if it is very ripe, right? It is very soft and then you can just squish it like this. You can just press it like that. Um, so it is also like really has a lot of water or wet in, in a sense. And 
eating all this jamun, you can see Nima's tongue is all in blue color. When it's winter and the days get shorter and it's cold outside, what's Nima eating today? So during winters, it's cold and the days are also shorter. So what fruits or vegetables do we have during winter time? Winter is the season for shiny leafy vegetables. Beetroot, red like the setting sun. Plump green custard apples. Look, look, Nima's climbing up a tree now. Oh ho, she's plucked all the sour brown tamarinds. So during winter, there are a lot of leafy vegetables like spinach. And then of course, you have beetroot, which is red like the sun that sets. And custard, green custard apples, sita fal, you know that, right? That is custard apple. And look, look, Nima is climbing on some tree. What tree is that? It is the tamarind tree. You can see the tamarind, brown tamarind out here, right? Which is all like sour in taste. She's plucking that. And what do you do when you eat something that is sour, like tamarind or even lemon? You say, you do it that, like that, right? And that's what Nima is doing as well. Nima loves to eat, but she loves to eat with the season. Chomp, chomp, chew, chew, mmm, mmm. So Nima does love to eat, but she also eats what is available in that season. During the rainy season, she eats something. During the summer season, she eats a lot of mangoes. During the uh, winter season, she eats beetroot, tamarind. So why do we eat what is available in the season? Because it tastes better. And the vegetable or fruit also has the best as the most vitamins in it as well, because it is apt to grow that vegetable or fruit in that season. It is also more environmentally better to eat vegetables and fruits that naturally grow in that season. Across the world, there are five types of seasons, spring, summer, monsoon, autumn, and winter. But in some places in India, like where Nima lives, the seasons are summer, monsoon, and winter. So there are five different types of seasons usually. Spring, that is when slowly the flowers start coming by. So that is also known as the Vasanta Ritu, right? To the spring season when flowers bloom after the cold winter, right? That's summer is the hot, hot, sunny season. Monsoon is the rainy season. Autumn is when is the time when all the leaves fall from the trees. And winter, of course, we know is the cold season. So usually there are these five seasons, but in some places in India, where especially where Nima lives, there are only summer, monsoon, and winter seasons. Eat with the season. Like Nima, you can eat colorful and tasty fruits and vegetables across the year. Here's a seasonal calendar so that you know which fruits and vegetables to eat through the year. Tamarind, January to February. Chikkus, January to February and May to July. Mulberries, March to May and October to November. So here is a list of fruits and vegetables that they have given and what time or what months they are available. And it's always good to eat uh, what is available in that month because you get the maximum benefit out of it. So this is tamarind, chikkus, and this is these mulberries or these berry type of fruits. And you can see when they are available. Spinach, March to May and October to January. This is spinach. Mango, March to August. We all love mangoes. Watermelon, April to June the big round fruit. Lychees, May to June. 
So these are how lychees look and they have like a soft white flesh inside with a big seed as well. Jamuns, May to July, these are the jamuns. Corn, June to August, this is the corn. Sweet lime, July to August, these are sweet limes, also known as mosambi. Custard apple, October to February, it's also known as sita phal. Beetroot, all year, but best eaten in winter. So I hope you got some information from the story as to what fruits are available at what time during the year. And I hope you also consume or eat uh, maximum the fruits that are available at that season so that it's good for your health. Thank you. Check out some of the fruits and how they look. Lychees, German fruit, Custard apples, mulberries. Try these questions. What is the benefit of eating fruits or vegetables that are available in the season? Can you list some other fruits and vegetables that you eat but are not listed in the story and the season it's available? Thank you.